Hello, good morning everyone. As we saw on the previous video, we saw the advantage on using a linear regression instead of other moving average to detect the trend. So we can use that advantage in defining a trade setup where we enter the market each time the slope of a linear regression changes. If we compare the linear regression with one of the fastest moving average, which is the HMA, let's compare both lines with the same period. The HMA, HMA in blue color. The, one of the most important advantages is that the linear regression is less susceptible to small pullbacks as we can see on this small pullback the slope remains to the downside while the HMA, the blue line, uh, remains horizontal or even it can change the slope to positive so it can trigger false signals so coming back to the linear regression how can we enter the market each time we get a change on the trend so on the slope direction the obvious way is to enter the market at the first bar where we see the line going in a different direction on this bar we can see it is sloping up so we, can, we enter long and as soon as it starts going down on this bar we enter short there is an easiest way to detect this visually and it is using another instance of the same indicator this, this is valid for any indicator to detect a, a change on the trend we add two instances of the same indicator but displaced one bar the only difference between the two indicators is the displacement I will replace the non-displaced line with a blue color and now we can see that visually it is easier to detect when the red line is above the trend is to the downside when the blue line is over the red line the trend is to the upside so the only the only that we need to do the only thing we need to do is to wait for a cross when the red crosses above the blue line then we enter short and when the blue line crosses above the red line we enter long This is a very easy method to detect a trend change and valid for any line. If we want to use a custom indicator, instead of using this method, we can use the slope color indicator. I will replace remove the other indicators and here we specify which is the line that we want to track we select the HMA sorry the uh, linear regression with the and we specify if you want to paint the bars paint the line show the line and also show markers this indicator paint arrows and here we can see it is much easier to follow the, the trace setup when we get a red arrow we enter short when we get a blue arrow we enter long the best way to see if the setup works is using market replay as we can see 
on this chart this example uh, is two days long it is on fast replay Here we are using the, the markers system to automate the signals. The system allows to automate any signal. For this example, I am automating red arrows and blue arrows to enter short or long. If we have the marker plus version, then it also includes a slope detection tool. Let's see an example. We can use the slope tool and here we select the indicator that we want to track. The linear regression with a period of 50 and we can also select a threshold And as we can see, we get the same signals. This is the, the example that we used on the market replay example. We can add the line. So we can see the, the line that we are looking at the, at the slope. Hope this setup has been useful for you. If you have any question, please post below this video. Thank you everyone. Bye bye.